Hey everyone, in today's video, I am going to show you how to create custom keyboard shortcuts in Windows 11. No coding, no third party tools, just using what's already built into Windows. First, let's assign a shortcut key to an app. We will use Notepad++ as an example. But you can use any app installed on your system. Right click anywhere on your desktop, hover over new and then click on shortcut. Now it's asking for the location of the app. You can click browse or type in the full path manually. I will browse to my notepad++ installation and select the .exe file. Then click next. Now give your shortcut a name. I will go with notepad++ and click finish. Your shortcut is now on the desktop. Right click on it and choose properties. Make sure you are in the shortcut tab. Then click into the shortcut key field. Now press the key combo you want. Let's say I do Ctrl Alt N. Windows will auto format it for you. And don't worry. If you accidentally press something weird like Ctrl, Alt, Mute, Left Elbow, Windows will just ignore it, mostly. Click Apply and then OK. Now whenever I press Ctrl, Alt, N, Notepad++ opens instantly. Next, let's assign a shortcut key to a folder. This is super handy if you frequently open a folder like downloads, projects or screenshots. Just like before, right click on your desktop, go to new and then choose shortcut. Now type the full path to the folder or browse to it if that's easier. I will use my downloads folder as an example. Click next, give it a name like downloads and click finish. Now right click the new shortcut and choose properties. Just like we did for the app. Click into the shortcut key field and press a combo. I am going with Ctrl Alt D for downloads. Apply and OK. And now every time I hit Ctrl Alt D, my download folder opens up instantly. Alright, last example. Let's create a shortcut key to open a specific file. This could be a PDF, Excel sheet, Word doc or even a presentation. Just like before, right click on the desktop, choose new and then click shortcut. This time I will browse and choose a file. Let's say I want a shortcut to a PDF file. Once selected, click next, name it something like ABC PDF and hit finish. Now. Right click the shortcut, go to properties and stay in the shortcut tab. Click inside the shortcut key box and press your key combo. Here I will use Ctrl Alt R. Apply, OK and that's it. One shortcut key now opens up my PDF document anytime I need it. To remove a shortcut, click inside the box, press backspace. Apply. Done. And that's it. You have now learned how to create keyboard shortcuts for apps, folders and files. If you found it useful, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or suggestions for topics you want me to cover, please drop a comment below. I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.